The popular television show Riverdale, based on the Archie comics, is not known for its realistic portrayal of events or adherence to logic. However, it does present some interesting ideas and plot elements related to science. One of these ideas is the concept of a serial killer gene, which supposedly causes one character in the show to enter a trance-like state and commit terrible acts, including murder. While this may sound far-fetched, there is some truth to this plot detail. The so-called serial killer gene actually refers to the MAOA gene, which produces an enzyme called monoamine oxidase A. This enzyme is important for breaking down certain chemicals in the brain, including neurotransmitters like serotonin, dopamine, and norepinephrine. These neurotransmitters play a crucial role in regulating our emotions and behavior. If there is a problem with the way the MAOA gene functions, it can lead to a buildup of these neurotransmitters in the brain, resulting in aggressive and impulsive behavior. The connection between the MAOA gene and violence was first discovered in the 1990s when researchers studied a large Dutch family with a history of extreme violence and antisocial behavior. They found that many of the male members of that family had a genetic mutation in their MAOA gene. This led to the term warrior gene being used to describe the mutated gene that caused such aggressive behavior. However, it is important to note that not everyone with a mutated MAOA gene will become a violent criminal or serial killer. Numerous factors, including environmental influences and other genetic components, contribute to a person's overall behavior. In fact, research has shown that the link between the MAOA gene and aggression is stronger when a person has experienced a difficult or abusive childhood. Therefore, it is not correct to say that the mutated MAOA gene alone can turn a person into a serial killer. Instead, it may simply be one of the many factors that contribute to a person's propensity for violence and antisocial behavior. The term serial killer gene might be a catchy phrase used in television shows like Riverdale, but it's an oversimplification of a complex interaction between genetics and environmental factors. Additionally, the portrayal of the character of Riverdale entering a fugue state and committing violent acts is not an accurate representation of the effects of the MAOA gene mutation. Such a dissociative phenomenon would be extremely rare and not necessarily linked to the gene. It is crucial to clarify that while the MAOA gene may contribute to certain violent tendencies, it does not guarantee that a person will become a murderer or a violent criminal. In conclusion, the concept of a serial killer gene as portrayed in the television show Riverdale is a dramatic and exaggerated representation of the real-life relationship between the MAOA gene and aggression. While there may be a scientific basis for the gene's contribution to violent behavior, it is important to understand that such violence is not a predetermined fate for those with the mutation. Multiple factors, including genetic and environmental influences, contribute to a person's behavior and actions. The firm serial killer gene may be an attention-grabbing plot device, but it does not capture the full complexity of the scientific connection between genetics and human behavior.